Now, if you're new to Bricks Builder or you've been using it for a little while, you may be thinking, how do I create anchor links and use those in my design? It isn't immediately obvious and one of those little things that when you know, you know, but if you don't, you kind of get the idea. So let me show you, first of all, what an anchor link is, how you can use it, and then we'll see how easy it is to actually set one up and apply smooth scrolling to it. So this is an example. You can see I've got this view pricing button, just a standard button in Bricks. If I click, it'll scroll down the page and then stop at the relevant section inside our design. In this example, the pricing section. So that's what an anchor link allows us to do. Immediately jump to a relevant part of our page or design. And let's take a look at how we actually enable it and start working with it. So I've opened up that same page inside Bricks Builder and I've removed any anchor links and anything else inside this. We're starting with a blank slate. Let's select the button we want to use, the view pricing button. We're going to come to our link type and we're going to set this to be a custom URL. Now we need to put a link inside you, but what link do we use? Well, this is where it operates slightly differently to what you expect. So what you need to do is simply go to the section we want to jump to, in this example, the pricing section. With that selected, make sure we have no global class selected. Just deselect that. And you see this gives us the unique ID. All we need to do is copy this. And you can use this option, or we can just use the copy CSS ID from here. That will copy that. Now we're going to go back to our hero section, choose our button, come over to our link, and simply paste that in. And you see that push the little hash symbol, or pound symbol if in the US, and then it puts in the relevant CSS ID. Let's save this and test this out on the front of our site. Let's hit view pricing and it jumps immediately to that section. However, it didn't scroll, it just jumped straight to it. And that doesn't look very good. And this is because an option inside the brick setting has to be enabled to give you that nice smooth scrolling effect. So to access that, all we need to do is go back into the dashboard of WordPress, come into our brick settings and into the general tab, come down to the miscellaneous and choose the option for smooth scroll CSS. Select it, save the settings, and now if we try that link out one more time, you'll see we get that nice smooth scrolling effect that takes us to the relevant section inside our design. So that's how easy it is to add these anchor links in and apply the CSS smooth scroll to make everything look pretty smooth and pro. If you want to learn more about working with Bricks Builder, check out this link with a playlist. There's tons of options inside there to get you up running and get more at Bricks. As always, all applicable links in the description. My name is Paul C. This is WP Tuts. Until next time. Take care.